Joining us right now at six, we start with our big story tonight, campaign 2022 and the final campaign stops. The election is just four days away and the candidates are all over the state. And of course, we are your election authority tonight. Channel 3's chief political reporter Susan Raff is live on the campus of Eastern Connecticut State University where Democrats held a rally. Susan. Erin, Election Day is almost here. This coming Tuesday, voters will go to the polls and make their choices. As for Democrats, they were here in the eastern part of the state today making their final pitches. We also caught up with some Republicans on the shoreline. In these final hours, Democrats are making a big push to get out the vote. Here at Eastern Connecticut State University, they're reaching out to college students. I thought Roe v. Wade was settled law. I thought gay rights and gay marriage was here forever. You know, I thought that um, we were going to finally get rid of those assault weapons once and for all. It's all coming back in the other direction. The issues in this election are important. Voters will decide whether Ned Lamont should be elected for a second term or if Republican Bob Stefanowski should be the state's next governor. This is Stefanowski's second go around. Most people don't feel like Connecticut where it needs to be. If we're going to change Connecticut, we have to change governors. Stefanowski and Laura Devlin, the Republican candidate for lieutenant governor, were in East Lyme, speaking to voters at Flanders Fish Market and Restaurant. We have been to every corner of the state and every place in between, and regardless of political party or demographic, people are saying the same thing. It is time for a change. For voters, these are some of the issues most important to them women's rights to their body to choose what they want to have done with their own body and um, I think the police force need to get more recognition. Taxes because I'm a homeowner here so that's important to me I mean it's it's kind of like you know checking the the tax increases every year. Uh, schools or that's one of the reasons that we moved to East Lyme because they, they have a really good school system so just maintaining that. A lot is at stake in this election, and the issues are important. Republicans are planning a big rally tomorrow in Wallingford, and the guest speaker is former New Jersey Governor Chris Christie. We are told that event will be at United Concrete, and the doors open at 10 a.m. We are live tonight at Eastern Connecticut State University in Willimantic. Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right.